Well, here we have our houseboat at uh, Tugboat Annie's West Bay Marina with our beautiful about 600 and some square foot houseboat. I'm just going to walk you around and have a look, showing you a few details. Here is the back entry. It's got a beautiful spiral staircase. I'm showing the outside first. It's got vinyl siding. And the vinyl siding is done on purpose because for one thing it's very light. Secondly, it's indestructible practically and it will never need to be painted, which will take on the weather beautiful. We got a nice undercover porch here, entryway with a nice curved post, and uh, very beautiful up there. Look at that curved wall up there that we put in. Got that beautiful red door entry, and wait till you see the inside. It's just beautiful. Look at this. Very nautical. Got the nice round window. Beautiful blue and white interior with the pinstripe ship lap material, which is not, you know, just painted wood it's actually uh, pieces and we got a nice little Juliet balcony there we got the eating bar here on the left got the kitchen got the nice uh, curved ceiling with the blue I call it the blue jean blue jean roof that's the color I put in there with the old-fashioned fridge and we got a nice wood countertop notice the tile around the window how beautiful that is it's a nice addition keeps the window sill never rotting uh, never decaying. We've got a beautiful curved staircase here with the uh, stainless steel spindles. And then we have a little island here on there in the right. That's my wine bar and my uh, coffee bar. Then we got the back door there as you can see. This is going to go into the bed bathroom. And then to the right that will be the um, laundry room. Here's the shower as you can see. Beautiful glass sliding door with a round top. So nice, beautiful. A little small sink there is all you need. And then you got uh, here, I think I show you. Yeah, here it is. Here's the uh, laundry room. That's where the um, washer and dryer will go. Got a little extra nook there. Here is the door that serves as a bathroom door for the toilet, as well as you can open it up that way and lock it that way, and that gives you access to the whole area. Little toilet there, RV toilet. Uh, needs to be pumped out about once a month. And they have a service there right at the marina for that. And uh, then you got, uh, let's see here, I'm gonna go upstairs now. And this is a beautiful staircase. As you can see, it's kind of sanded out to uh, give you that uh, worn in look, but it's beautiful. Uh, and then we've got the carpeted upside, upside bedroom and with the nice uh, wooden ceiling, tongue and groove pine and uh, Lots of details, and then also up this room. Also, this room also has a uh, little uh, balcony on the left side, which is uh, to be a balcony with a round closet. Got a round window here to match downstairs. Just a nice feel. <clears throat> you can see the the balcony right on the right side. Laying in bed there, and you open that up. It's so beautiful. And then we got the uh, outside patio. Now the patio can be accessed from either walking through the bedroom, or you can come up the uh, curved spiral staircase from down below. It seats a lot of people up here as you can see there's two full sets of couches I think you probably easily fit up eight people up there ten people there's the downstairs that's the patio down below that's the entry and uh, there we go and then we got a little covered area for the porch where if you're having a barbecue up there or in any way you want to stay outside, well, if it happens to rain, you got a covered area there. It's beautiful. And then you come in back in the bedroom here. Got a little red light because I always like that on boats. You can have that going. And all those are all on different lights, all on different lights. And um, then you go down the stairs here. Let's see what we got. What we got going here. We've got the back door now. I'm going to show you how that looks. It's white on this side, red on that side. And then you got the curved spiral staircase going up there. It's a really nice feel. All light blue, a very peaceful blue color for the trim amongst the whole outside. Inside has more of a blue jean trim and a lot of stainless steel outside corner posts. Everything for long longevity. That's a bamboo curtain there, which I really like. 
and uh, lots of stainless steel on there just to kind of bring it up a notch and then also create a great longevity. And then we're gonna, there's that, there's that window. Here we go through outside. And then we have the beautiful arched roof. Anyway, great. Yeah, and then I got this uh, beautiful ship's wheel from uh, a ship that was dismantled from the 1901. There's another shot of the outside at night, how beautiful it was. We ended up moving the whole, look at that, that's beautiful. Anyway, thank you for watching this wonderful creation that took me about five months. One of my favorite jobs, and you can still rent that place in Olympia on Airbnb if you want. Anyway, thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video. That's why half of them are still white. <laughs> exactly. People think that's a design. Wow, what an excellent design they had on the wow, handrail. Wow, this pattern is really Part unique. white, part really, uh, blue. I love it. Done. Oh, yeah, but actually, it's because, oh, like, fuck you, Dad. Yeah, I can't read it. It's way on there. <laughs> I love it. We meant to do that. You know what I'm saying? We meant to do that. What a beautiful night here. John and Kaylin, it is July 6th. And sorry for the bright light, but it just came on our phone. We're just, we're just loving our moment here because Oak and I built this whole thing out here. And it's a covered area that it started raining today. We just got to sit back in here on our little couches here. It's awesome, man. Such a beautiful environment. Beautiful. We got look at the cafe. Like it's so nice out here at night. It's freaking beautiful. What would you do in this moment? Yeah, it's great. Man.